My name is Beatriz Elgore Snow, I'm a pianist, and I want to share with you the first of six videos that I'm preparing on six different composers. This first one is a piece by composer Florence Price for cello and piano that I recorded with my husband, cellist Andrew Snow. And before you watch that video, I would like you to watch a very short introduction about her life and work. Thank you so much for watching and listening. Florence Price, her maiden name was Smith, was born in 1887 in Little Rock, Arkansas, and died in 1953 in Chicago. She started her music studies with her mother, who was a teacher. Her father was the only black dentist in Little Rock at the time. She is the first African-American woman composer to have her work performed by symphony orchestra. Her first symphony was performed by the Chicago Symphony Orchestra in 1933 at the Auditorium Theater after she won first prize at a composition competition. After graduating high school as a valedictorian, she studied music at the prestigious New England Conservatory in Boston, majoring in organ and piano performance. She moved to Chicago with her husband and two daughters in 1927 during segregation, trying to escape racial tensions in Arkansas. In Chicago, she studied composition and orchestration at the University of Chicago and the now Chicago College of Performing Arts of Roosevelt University. After her divorce, she played the organ for silent movies to support herself and began composing more than ever. Her friend, wonderful singer Marian Anderson, championed Price's success as a composer, singing her works at her concerts. Florence Price, musical style combines the classical European romantic tradition with elements of spirituals, West African rhythms, and dance. She wrote four symphonies, three piano concertos, and a violin concerto, and dozens of orchestral, piano, vocal, and chamber music works. She is now recognized as one of the most important composers of her generation, and her works are performed by major symphony orchestras and musicians all over the world.